Hi, I'm Anna Ross Davies from All Together Equestrian here at Childerton on this beautiful sunny morning and we are going to do some how-to training videos to help you improve your dressage training and your dressage tests. So we're going to show you um, how to do a correct give and retake which can sometimes be a little bit misunderstood. Again, we're working with a novice horse here um, as this movement is in some of the novice and elementary dressage tests. So with the give and retake, this is a release of the rein. It should be over three strides. The idea of this is that it shows that the horse is in self-carriage without the support of the rider's hand. And it's to demonstrate to the judge that the horse is in his own balance. When you perform the give and retake of the reins, the rider's hand should go forward to the bit and there should be a clear release of the contact. Sometimes you see riders putting their hands up, but keeping contact, and that is not a give and retake. Give and retake is where the rider completely loses connection with the horse's mouth over three strides. So the hands go forward on the first stride, hold the release for the second stride, and slowly come back over the third stride. And so Beth is going to demonstrate this for you with the lovely Barossa. Okay, Beth, off you go. And we're gonna do this on a 20 meter circle. The rider needs to make sure that the horse is in good balance. So it's always important to ride a half halt before you ride the give and the retake. So Beth will come round on the circle and half halt Barossa and now give the rein. Good, okay, and as you can see there, that's a very clear give and retake. We're going to do that again. Make the circle a little bit smaller, Beth. That's it, okay, so a good half halt now and slowly release the rein and back. And that's a very good demonstration of a correct give and retake. 